Yeah, what's up? What's up? What's up? Is it a good morning? Yes, it's a good morning, huh? It sure is. Fluffy off, heel. <laughs> you guys see that? Fluffy sits. All right, welcome back, everybody. If you don't know who I am, my name is Daniel the Big O. I'm out here with the Fluffy Poodle. That's right, Mr. Fluffy Bear and his aquamarine bluish hair. Um, we are going to run some errands today. We got to go check on these chickens. We have to make sure everything is good to go because it's springtime and we got to get ready for spring. So sit back, relax, follow us, and see what, we're, see what we can get into today. All right, guys? Come on, boy. He's going straight to the chickens, make sure they're still alive. Every evening we move the chicken coop to a new patch of grass so they have something fresh to eat. Uh, but every morning we come down to make sure they're still alive, nothing ate them during the night time, and uh, to see if we have any eggs. You guys ready to check them out? This is our portable chicken coop. It houses five chickens, three hens, and one rooster. The rooster is the black and white one right there. One over there to the left, that's a uh, American game fowl, and we have two golden comets. It looks like there's one right here in this nesting box. They got plenty of water and food. Let's check out the one that's in the nesting box. Does it have any eggs? Oh, we scared it out. Any eggs in here today? Yep, oh, a broken one down there. We'll have to clean that up. No eggs this morning, it's still a little early. Uh, normally they lay in between breakfast and lunchtime. That's when they normally lay their eggs. All right, so we checked on the chickens. Now we have to get the top on the back of the truck, the portable top. The, we got to put it on the back of the truck real quick because we got to go pick up some stuff. It shouldn't be too heavy. It really shouldn't be. You gonna help me, Fluffy? Here. Come here, boy. Good. Sit. Sit. Good. Stay. All right, so I got Mr. Fluffy Bear up here for a couple different reasons why I put this on. Get him used to that texture, that metal, the cold, the temperature difference. Yeah. Put this on. Well, that took a lot longer than expected and my hands are dirty, so now we gotta go clean them. We checked the chickens, we got the back of the truck topper on, and we washed our hands. Let's hit the road and go to the grocery store and go get some things. Fluffy, break. Good boy. Woo wee. So let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a little bit windy out here today. Um, we got a good storm coming the next three, two, three weeks. Um, some rain off and on. It's springtime, but we need rain to get those mushrooms to start growing so we can go out and pick some of those awesome, awesome morel mushrooms that are delicious. They're, mwah, they're a lip smacker like, <laughs> oh man all right mr fluffy look at him right there you ready to go yeah let's go to the store Good morning, how are you? Good, good. So we made it over here to the Mart of Wool. We have to get a big old tote for some hunting gear, and then we have to get some socks because my son said, Dad, I need some socks. So we're gonna go over and get him a, a pack of socks because he was running a little low. So let's get those two things and We'll see you guys here in a second. So what's funny is in like the past 
month to two months, I've washed my wallet at least 10 to 20 times because I don't check pockets. So uh, we're gonna get myself a new wallet right here. Now, now real quick, um, I, I need your guys' advice. You comment down below, is a card case, tri-fold, or slim bifold? Which one do you prefer? Slim bifold, that's what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get the slim bifold, throw it in the cart. We got a wallet, we got some socks, and next we gotta go and get those totes, throw them in the cart so we can uh, have something to put our gear in. One, two, three. One, two, three. We got three and three. Um, that's enough for deer season, turkey season, and duck season to put our clothes in. Let's go to checkout. So we just got done at Walmart. When we were walking out, the lady goes, can I check your receipt? Um, no, you can't check my receipt. Why are you gonna check my receipt when I already paid for it? And if you think I was doing something bad, then it's easy. Security would have caught it. So look, at, uh, Walmart has a bunch of cameras. Stop checking my receipt when I leave the building. When you see that I have bags, I didn't go in there with a bunch of Walmart bags and just load up my, my cart for nothing. Come on, Walmart. Anyways, let's let's go over to the dog store and get Mr. Fluffy Bear. Let's go get him some uh, some food. Look, load up. Ooh, it's windy! It's windy! It's windy! Hey, quick tip: when you're loading up your service dog, don't shut the back door until your front door is open, so your dog can always come to you. Um, he can get to you just in case. Because if you shut the door and he can't get out, and something happens to you, how can he get to you? He'll be locked in. Yeah, we made it to the dog store. All right, so real quick, um, the food that we're going to get this time is, I think we're going to get the duck recipe. The duck recipe is really good. Um, it has the same omegas for his coat and stuff like that, so he don't have to worry about his coat losing that silkiness and uh, that, that really good coat that the Mr. Fluffy Poodle has. Um, Fluffy sit. Good stay. Looks like the, the wetlands, the wetlands roasted fowl is what we're gonna sit. The wetlands roasted fowl is what we're gonna get them this time. Um, just double check, it does have the same. Yeah, it still has the omega-6, omega-3s. His protein's still, still really good, but it's gonna give him a little more meat than that fish. Um, like I said, we use the fish during the winter time because it really helps with the coat, makes it really thick. And then in the summertime, the spring, summer, early fall, we transition to the sometimes bison or venison. But this time we're going to use that. Uh, we're going to try out that duck. Yeah. You want some of that duck? Yeah. All right, boy. Let's go. Let's go get you some treats. Hey, Mr. Fluffy Poodle. What do you think about these uh, Tundra Orion treats? You want to try those ones out? Yeah. It has goat, venison, boar, duck, lamb, and mackerel. Um, has has pretty much a mix of everything. Think that'll be good? Ooh, yeah. It's got a lot of protein. You'll like them. Yeah. Hey, I think it's only fair since Mr. Fluffy Bear has been working all day for me, we go take him to the park and... Uh, we let him play with his new toy that I bought him. It's a Frisbee, but it's a little more softer for his teeth, so uh, he can learn on it a little bit more. Um, hopefully he can catch it up in the air. So let's go over to the park and watch him have a little fun, all right? So we came over here to the dog park, right? Um, unfortunately, we don't let uh, Mr. Fluffy Bear inside that fence. 
taking your dog to a dog park is like taking a child to a crack house. It's just not gonna happen uh, with my dog. It's gonna be windy, it's gonna be a blown out audio. So what we're gonna do, right, is we're gonna set down the camera. I have that little uh, Frisbee. We're gonna let him play in this area right next to the dog park. Come here, boy. Yeah, yeah, come on. Yeah, come on, get it, boy. Ah, oh, it's a good boy. It's a good boy. This is his first time ever with a Frisbee. So, ouch, good boy, get it. Good boy, Bloody out. Good. Go get him, boy. This is first time ever with a Frisbee. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, let him know that, hey, this is a new toy. Figure it out. It's it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be okay. Yes, it got boy. Yes, it got boy. <laughs> Come on, boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Boy, yeah. Boy, Fluffy, you ready? You want to go get it, boy? Sit. Go get it. Catch it, catch it, catch it. Oh, he, he that wind caught it. Take it, good boy. Ah, yeah, come here. Heel. Good. Out. Good. Sit. Woo we're gonna keep this play session really short um really short and to the point we're gonna make them stay excited all right well i hope you guys had an amazing time i know myself and mr fluffy bear that's right mr fluffy bear and his blue hair aquamarine bluish green whatever color you want to call it had an awesome time doing a little shopping and then rewarding them with an amazing play session make sure you guys are spending awesome quality time with your dog i hope you guys are smiling having a beautiful and a I hope you guys had an amazing time. I know he, myself and Mr. Fluffy Bear had an awesome time. We'll see you guys next time uh, in a couple days on that video. Give me a high five. Bye-bye. <laughs>